Bloom regulates acoustic issues in spaces by opening its large knitted surface to absorb sound waves when attenuation is needed. When reverberant sound is desired, Bloom closes up to reduce its exposed surface area and permit increased reflection around the space that it inhabits. In conceiving of this project, our team was captivated by the idea of a responsive, interactive acoustic cloud that can be folded as simply as origami paper by using technical knits, smart materials, coded movement, and small printed components. The geometry of the knitted origami surface is based on pedesis, wherein slightly dissimilar triangular shapes repeat in an aperiodic manner, thus absorbing a broad range of sound frequencies. Each flower cluster that makes up the surface of Bloom is tailored and designed from fiber to shape. By being able to custom design the fiber yarns, we control the acoustic qualities of Bloom and its lightweight construction. Every single stitch is digitally programmed, which creates the shape and folds instantly for direct application. Additionally, the Angora fibers that will be used in the technical knit will have a hollow structure that can absorb sound. The structure of the Angora fluff interrupts sound reflection, and the sound waves are diminished as they propagate within the surface itself. Bloom has the capability to be adjusted in scale, material, and color due to the use of digital knitting technology and the repetition of modular, lightweight components that can be easily fabricated and transported for installation. Therefore, the entire system is designed to be infinitely variable. This approach gives us the freedom to easily customize Bloom for specific environments. It could be installed in galleries, intimate restaurants and conference rooms, or large airports, schools, auditoriums, and libraries. To date, we have made a small proof-of-concept prototype in New York City, but there is still much to discover. As this project evolves, we hope to discover how Bloom might be installed in a variety of diverse environments and observe how it might adapt to change the acoustics of spaces as people interact with it.